April is here. You know what that means. Unpredictable weather, allergies, and tax season. But April also means something else very important. Financial Literacy Month. It's an effort to highlight the importance of financial literacy and to teach Americans how to establish and maintain healthy financial habits. While it's great to have a month dedicated to this cause, it's also important not to let the momentum fade and to take an interest in your money habits throughout the year. So why should you care? Well, for starters, the unemployment rate for young adults is twice the national average. And 80% of young adults say they don't have the skills to make basic financial decisions. Four in 10 people would give themselves a C, D, or F on the knowledge about personal finance, and just 18% of 20 to 29 year olds are confident they will have enough money to live comfortably when they're ready to retire. Finally, people in their 20s are carrying average debt loads of $45,000, a number that rises every year as the cost of college continues to increase. Now, you probably haven't had a lot of exposure to financial education. Just four states require a semester of instruction on personal finance, and only another 19 require any kind of financial education training in the classroom. The good news is that you can begin to do something about it. We think the key is being informed and educated about your money decisions. Take a few minutes to learn about your options and do a little basic research to make sure that you're making a smart financial decision. It's up to you to take control of your finances and make sure that you're doing smart things with money. Yes, April is Financial Literacy Month, but make sure that you keep your personal finances in mind every month of the year.